Well, the two men accused of killing farm manager Brandon Horner are expected back in the Senegal Magistrate Court in the Free State today. Sikweche Masamba and Sikula Matalitsa are accused of strangling and stabbing the 21-year-old on a farm outside Paul Rue earlier this year. There's been chaos and conflict during their previous court appearances, including the burning of a police vehicle. My colleague, ENCS Aviwe Mdila, is outside court this morning. Can we begin here, uh, Aviwe, as we say good morning to you? Just remind us what should be happening in court today, because the suspects have appeared before. Yes, the last time they appeared, Bratan, was on the 22nd of October when the matter was postponed for further investigations. Now, of course, that was also the bail applica uh, application for the two applicants, accused number one, uh, Mashamba, as well as accused number two, Mashaletsa. Uh, Mashamba was denied bail, accused number one. The magistrate Dion van Royen citing that there's a prima facie um, case and prima facie evidence that's been presented. For one, he was seen um, coming from the direction of uh, where Brandon and Hona was murdered and for two his girlfriend said that on the night that the murder happened she woke up in the middle of the night and he wasn't there coming back only in the morning that's Mashamba and on the day that he was uh, arrested by the police uh, there were blood stains that were found on uh, the clothes that were found where he stays and also just the witness accounts uh, two independent witnesses saying that um, he had confessed of um, assaulting a white farmer uh, essentially which is believed to have been Brendan Horner so on those uh, just prima facie evidence magistrate Dion van Royen said that he could not be released on bail but accused number two was then uh, released on 5,000 rand bail. Now, just uh, just um, moments ago, I had a conversation with the NPA spokesperson in the Free State, confirming that on the day uh, that accused number two was released, in fact, he was then re-arrested uh, for two counts of rape, as well as two counts of kidnapping, uh, which he said to appear for as well at the Senate Kill Magistrate Court. So, um, while he was granted bail, he was then re-apprehended by the police and remain, remained in custody, and both of them are expected to appear at the Senate Kill Magistrate Court. Yeah, and outside court are things calm I mean unlike in the past where we saw those protesters and some conflict even a police vehicle being burnt Certainly much calmer scenes outside court. The police are there, but they're not even um, in the numbers that we've seen in previous appearances. There is about three police nyalas outside the Senegal Magistrate Court and a few police vans, but there isn't even that barbed wire that they normally bring along um, when this matter is uh, appearing or the matter of those uh, people that are charged relating that torching of the police van. So much calmer scenes outside. And in fact, in court, we're not expecting uh, long proceedings. We're expecting it either to be remanded for further investigations once more or if the state is ready and concluded with its investigations the matter then will be taken to the high court a trial date then will be set here today so um, it's either of the two that we're expecting here uh, at the Seneca magistrate court thank you very much Aviwem dealer in the free state the outside the Seneca magistrate's court